Oh boy, 3.31 a.m. Shit. With the WWE Championship controversially vacated in the summer of 2011, I fought and clawed to the finals of the WWE title tournament with my opponent, The Miz. I think I saw this. I had to face three different opponents to get yeah, to the top I was still of the watching. tournament. Dolph Ziggler, R-Truth, and then The Miz. I hate The Miz inside that ring. Cause he's very dangerous. You'll do anything to win. Miz. Maybe we weren't in the middle of a huge personal rivalry, but there was no chance I was going to let the Miz stand in my way of finally winning the WWE Championship. With an opponent as tricky as he is, I have to be ready for anything. Every time you face him, you just don't know what he's gonna come up with to try to steal one from you. Which can make the whole pace of the match <laughs> feel guy. fast and chaotic, but I thrive in that environment. And that night, I was going to use every bit of my experience to get that victory. Hell yeah. Dum, bum, 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 bum. Crap. Uh, a front like grapple. Okay. Get up, bro. Come on. The red and white. Hey, yo, Money Mike. It's not. <laughs> Fuck you, PDT. Fuck you, pa. No, dude, stupid. Isn't that it? Okay. Now open things up in the uh, in days of minutes with a grab combo. Fuck. Oh. This probably won't be it. Okay, definitely not it. It's all good though. Two, three. Show the mobile on now. Point two front running in front of the side. Sorry, two. That's one. That should count as one, bro. Come on. Bring it, 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 bring it. What am I doing? Fuck. Spook. God damn. Hey man, you hit the ref. Thanks to you. There we go, that's two. Next up, now cut into the maze with a uh, front light attack. Alright. Ow, my mouth. Uh -huh. Dude, the Miz is rocking like a like a goldish, a or like a gold ground something on the roof and all that. Looks pretty cool. But he was cutting me off at every turn in this match. He wasn't joking around. Is that? That looks like disturbed. The logo. Miz is definitely came looking about? to the prove face, his last frame more than a fluke. He was ready for sure. everything early on. And had me rocked. Even his like, early. what's it called, trunks or whatever? Hey, San Diego. Yo soy de San Diego. Maybe I have come in taking this a little lightly. But I can tell you, after I kicked out here, I understood that I was going to be in a dog fight. Despite his team saying otherwise, the on crap this night, night he and, had uh, not come out to play. Cause big damage in or out of the ring. Damn it. The Irish whip. Okay. I'll try that anyways. At the, into the stairs at ringside. Oh shit. Let me do this first. This should be pretty big damage. Okay, I 
team to look than I thought. Alright, take this outside, bro. Take this outside. Get up. You're good. You're good. Nothing hurts. Great fucking game cut. Oh, okay. Whoa, look at that. Oh, yeah. Anonymous general manager. Who could it be? Who could it Get up, bro. Come on. God damn it. Yes, you <laughs> uh, an Irish trip into the stairs at ringside. Come on. What? What? Oh, that worked. No. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> okay, over here. Over here, Dan. Six, what up, Dan? There we go. There we go. Hurt news. Man, this game really doesn't like news. Kapuka. Uh, don't let the Miz escape. I was looking into the corner. I'll stay on the attack. Okay. Okay. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> okay. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, shit. Now I'm getting hit. Thanks, bro. Thanks a lot, bro. I just needed something to buy a minute because Miz was coming strong. Thankfully, the ring post was right there when I needed it. Raw, raw rocks. Yeah. I really thought that was it. Miz was hurt pretty bad. I was a little deflated when he kicked out, and I truly think I lost my focus there for a minute. Yes, Shrek, dude. Miz took advantage when I let frustration take over for a second. And that DDT Man. that he hit me with had me seen stars. Maybe he didn't get the pin there. I don't oh, know. But if I made another mistake like that, I was going to pay. Look, Miz would be leaving the this, arena but... with his second WWE championship. Oh, front and then grapple. Just slow him down. There we go. Don't waste any time. In the middle of a rope, grab the pin. Yeah, there we go. Now you're back in this. Flatten the Miz with a dive attack while he's in the... He's grounding the ring. Okay. You do like this. Ha <laughs> ha. Isn't that a diving attack? While standing on the top rope with the opponent down in the ring. Oh, I'm stupid. You right, you right, you right, you right. Oh, what's up? Yo, rolling. Now dial up to 619. All right. Dial up to 619 for the moves. Fight. Shit. 
Listen, listen, listen Broski. I should be able to just R2 or R2. Yeah. Please tell me I got this. No doubt about it. He's a front heavy draft. You're almost done, you little punk. Oh, I get punched. Oh my god. Oh my god, he looks funny. He looks funny. The Wiz. I was truly fortunate that Miz, probably a little impatient there, grabbed me when I was so close to the ropes. If I can't get my head on the ropes, he probably ends this match right there. A costly mistake on his part. Let me hang in there a bit too long. By the time he was charging, I saw him clearly and basically played possum. After the match we had, I didn't want to get ahead of myself. But man, when I saw him hit those ropes, I knew it was over. Then the 619 landed. Oh shit. And oh I saw shit. Really oh shit. As I climbed those ropes. I never thought I'd hold the WWE Championship Ray when I started Mysterio. getting that three count on Miz, holding that championship in my hands. It was an incredible moment in my career. Dude, imagine an Undertaker, like an Undertaker showcase. That would have been Even sick. if it didn't last as long as I would have hoped. That would have been a crazy no long, long time on too. Away from me. And without someone like The Miz to push me in that bout, I truly wouldn't know if it would have meant as much as it did. Who is that? Oh, God, 619, the red and white Rey Mysterio outfit. Uh, we got the Miz, I'm guessing 2011, Raw 2011, I guess, and that WWE Championship. Not After even the Bayley, it's away, just hands down better. I finally returned home to WWE and was looking Ooh, to make an impact and found myself in the crosshairs of the Samoan Submission Machine, Samoa, Samoa Joe. Joe. I Samoa believe Samoa Joe, Joe is very dangerous in many qualities. Ah, in this I didn't want to skip it. I mean, I'm probably not going to complete it anyways. So this is definitely new. Way newer. This is like... When, what, what time is this? 2020? Or not? Nah. A light running attack. What is it? A light running attack. Oh, shit. We're, we're off to a terrible start, dude. Holy shit. Ray Mysterio. That's my pueblo. So, take him off his feet with a light running attack. I mean, I think. I think I know. Bro, get in this freaking ring. What the fuck? I can see why, uh... Stop. Man. Uh, I, I forgot. Scott, I can I can see why Scott Steiner hates him. <laughs> All right. In the ring, keep some mojo on defense. All right. So in the ring, like combo. He's not even that way. Shit. That's why I played well.
Draft combo. Here we go. What the hell was that? Come on. Shit. Some bullshit. Yeah. Who is that guy? <laughs> I want to give him an award, man. Ah, oh, fuck. He deserves an award. Fucking shit. Does this count? Does this count? I don't think it counts, huh? Oh my god. Finally! Uh, Alright, now try to front light cracker and attack. Alright, cool. Joe thought he just do whatever he wanted of me. Look how he just tosses me out of the ring. But I was still okay. A little shook, but okay. That tope never had a chance. Just happy he didn't catch me there. Joe's a really strong dude, and I was risking being power bombed on the floor if this didn't work. Dude, that was I definitely overestimated the damage I'd done to Joe at this point. He just waited for me to oh. come to him, and I obliged. Huge, painful mistake right there. Ah, oh, shit. In the ring, okay. He's a heavy combo. Yeah, let's go Scorpion. Go for a heavy attack. While well, he's standing in the ring, trust me. <laughs> but I feel like I shouldn't. What am I doing? Uh, now we'll unleash a springboard attack and open him from the door while he's, while he's standing in the room. Sometimes while they're standing, sometimes while they're sitting. Or laid. Laid on the mat. Fuck. Okay. Yeah. Nah, I kid, I kid. Damn it. Every time. If this won't be square, circle, okay. Draw some more Joe with a front running grapple. Is that, does that count as front running grapple? No, it doesn't count. Okay. I didn't think it would. Oh. Okay, now time for a big attack. A form of front heavy grapple attack. It's on the, it's a mojo in the, in the end. Hey, okay. So the form of front heavy grapple. Come on, Joe. Come on, Joe. Puyaka, puyaka, six, one, nine. That's Had my to get boy, creative bro. if I was going to win over Joe. I hey, hit him with something that yeah. he hadn't seen me do before. Just like that. Six, one, nine, but to the gut. Oh, then regular six, one, nine. Oh, shit, oh, shit. 619 Premium Never edition. had someone just uh, block the 619 before like Yep, that. that's Joe. That's the more Joe. Fast. Precision beats Samoa Joe's honestly going to smell you. Place the boot perfectly 
and got myself a little time just to breathe. But if I didn't do something, good, like this is gonna go like every other match I had with Joe. Oh my god. Relax, bro. Shit. Shit, damn. Oh man, this is like three amigos, but I, I don't know what this is called. Yeah, I'm not sure what it's called, to be honest. Damn it. So why though? Three like combos. Come on, man. Oh. I was pressing circle at first. Damn, dude. What the fuck? Okay, that was one. I thought it didn't count for some reason. I don't know if it's count. No, this is not a hit. That's not a light combo. It should be a. I think we're trying to show Joe how to dial the six dial up the six one nine. There we go. <laughs> Joel! Can I make a big run in front of the attack? A corner? I can make a big run in front of the attack. Oh crap. Oh, I thought he reversed it. A big run in front of the attack. Okay. Let's go this way. Hey! Aw. Oh. <laughs> every time, dude. Every time. And if you jump from the rope to Samoa Joe while he's standing, he's just gonna walk away. He's just gonna look at the crowd like, and walk away. But he waited just a little too long to act, and that gave me the time to realize what was happening. At least most of the time. I counter the Unagi. One, two, three. And finally, get the pinfall victory over him. Here is your winner. I know the United three, States Championship three. wasn't on the line that night, but beating Samoa Joe that night made me feel like a real champion. Dominic? Joe made me realize immediately in my return that WWE hadn't gone any easier, and I had to be on my A game each and every night. He's an incredible opponent, and not too bad of a guy. When he's not jumping you after you beat him for the U.S. Championship, I guess. No speak the Spanish, that's gonna be it for this one. <laughs> this one, uh, or unless the video's not long enough, then it'll be in this part. If not, this is the end of the part. Peace out, I'll see you guys. Thank you for watching, though. Next part, next video, let's go. Oh. Oh.